uh, the Archbishop's desire to root the new cathedral in its identity as a New York institution and as an American institution, showing that the Irish who, who built it were, were looking, once again, no longer toward Ireland anymore, but to the New York and to the United States. And building a huge cathedral as he did uh, was a statement not only to the Catholics, but to everyone else that the Catholics had finally arrived. And this house of God was to be a symbol of the fact that they were here in the new world, here in America, and were not going to leave. And from 1879 to 2011, it has never closed, except at night. But we've been open every single day from 1879 until today. Part of his plan to save money and make the cathedral affordable, this ceiling is not stone, it's made out of wood and plaster. It's a surprise, most people don't know that. Um, and above this ceiling, there is a, a roof, which is a typical uh, V-shaped roof on top of uh, the cathedral. Part of our restoration of the cathedral includes a cleaning of all of the pipes. There are, there are over 9,000 pipes to the organ. And part of the restoration of the, of the cathedral is to take down each and every pipe, to clean it, and eventually to put it back. If you look at the far right, you see how dark everything is. Well, that's basically just dirt. It's been here uh, since the last renovation of the cathedral in the early 70s. Uh, and if you just go one panel over, you can see the, the great difference in... If you notice this uh, stained glass window, it's one of the original ones that was put in in 1878. But this window was dedicated by the, the architect, uh, James Renwick. And it's probably the on, only stained glass window in, in a Catholic church that was given by someone who wasn't Catholic. Certainly the stained glass windows are, a, uh, are, an, are an item that will be difficult to deal with. There aren't too many people that are uh, expert in dealing with stained glass, especially for glass that's, that's this old.
Uh, some people w would be happy to say, all right, close the whole building until everything is done, and then we'll open it up again. But that's not even an option for us. It's a, a place that belongs to people from all over the world, and, and we will keep the, play the cathedral open. Uh, it will have certain parts that may be closed during the restoration, but the uh, huge majority of the cathedral will be open for everyone.